So I've seen on some of the posts in the forums where people are getting a service your tire mobility kit pop up. And I actually got one the first year that I had this vehicle and I couldn't figure out what in the world was that and how do I get rid of it. So I figured I'd kind of show you one, how to get rid of it and also kind of show you what it is. Your tire mobility kit is located in your trunk. So if you come right here, right there's the tire mobility kit. And basically what it is, it's a little air compressor with some sealant that you put into your tire that if you had a flat, a normal flat, just like a puncture in the tread itself, you could use this to temporarily fix your tire and then drive to a tire shop where you could actually get the tire fixed properly or a tire replaced. If you actually have something damaged on your sidewall and near your sidewall, doubt this is gonna work, but that's what it is. And it's right here where your spare tire would be. I know some people have just taken this out and put a spare in here. So got plenty of room for it. So there you go, in case you wondered what it is. So when you're using your tire mobility kit, if you're not sure about it, I don't know about your car, but I have a little hidden spot in my glove box and that's where my manual is. And if you go look in the back of the manual, It'll say, I think it's a, uh, let's take a look. Have tire sealant and inflator kit right there. It says it's on page 265 in my manual. I'm sure manuals are different every year, but if you look in the manual, you can see in the back and it'll tell you about the kit. And it'll tell you right here how to use it. And one of the things when I was looking through it, there's a few pages on how to use it. When you do, if you use this and you have to use it, it says leave your car running when you plug it into the 12 volt for the compressor so it won't don't drain your battery down. And one other thing it said is there is an expiration date on this. And here is mine. Mine is a 2020 Mustang. And if you look, my expiration date is... January 25th, 2025. So apparently it's a five year shelf life on these. So check yours, find out how old it is. I'm not saying you have to replace it, but I'm just telling you it does have a five year shelf life on it. So if for some reason you do get the pop-up that says service tire mobility kit, what you'd end up doing is going to your settings. Once you get to settings, just go to vehicle and mine's already on tire mobility kit, so you'll click it, and it'll give you a choice of one, two, three, or four years. I bought this car in 2021. It's a 2020 model, and it wasn't a few months after I had it, and I got the pop-up, and I had to figure out how to fix that. So I ended up going in and changing it to four years. You can just move it up to whatever you want. I have it on four years, so I won't get that pop-up again for four years, and that will clear the little pop-up you get on service tire mobility kit. Like I said, also, if it's five years old or older, Ford recommends replacing it. Up to you, I'm just giving you the recommendation. But at least you can clear the little pop-up for service tire mobility kit. That's how you would do it. And you can just go right back to your normal settings. And there you go. So hopefully this will be a help to you guys. Like I said, I had to go hunt and figure it out because I was like, what in the world? Why is this popping up? What's it mean? And so that's all it is. It's just basically telling you to check your expiration date on your mobility kit. If you've never used it, make sure that it's not over five years old. I'm not saying it won't work after that. That's just the recommendation. And use it just if you get a flat from a puncture in your tread, not on the sidewall or sidewall damage because that's not gonna help you there. But it would, it's basically like fix a flat. It'll put stuff in your tire to get you to where you need to do, where you could go get it patched, plugged, or whatever you need. So hopefully this was a help. I appreciate you guys. Have a great day.